This is the procedure to factory reset the Poly CCX400 phone without using the menu. And what we'll be doing is a, a key procedure, a number of different procedures using your fingers and power on. And uh, the tricky bit is to press your fingers in the top corners of the screen and the bottom corners of the screen at the right moments. And the procedure will be to power the phone on, wait for the Poly logo to appear, then we'll press in the top two and the bottom two corners for about one or two seconds. Then we'll release. And then when you see the red light come on, we will press the top two and the bottom two again. And then that should kick off the reset procedure. So let's give it a go. It doesn't matter if you're plugging in using mains cable adapter or the PRE power over Ethernet. Uh, the procedure is the same. So power on. We'll wait for our logo. Press top two, bottom two for one or two seconds. Release. Wait for the red light here. Press top two, bottom two again, and as you can see, we've got it recovery mode initiated to do the factory reset. And this will go through then and uh, wipe the phone. And the next prompt you'll see after it's done a few reboots will be the admin password prompt to put your own password in. So there we go, formatting data and cache. The Poly C60 is slightly different. I haven't got one here, but I'll do another video on that one. That one's easier. So for the C60 only, the Poly C60, all you do for that one is you plug in, you press top two and bottom two corners, just like on the same screen. And all you do there is hold. And then eventually after a few seconds, that will start the recovery procedure, just like this, the uh, factory re reset. So that one's easier, the C60. There's no uh, release and then press again. Um, the Poly CCX400 is the tricky one. Um, but kind of once you've got the, uh, the procedure down, it's fairly straightforward. And that's it. It's just going to go through now and the prompt will come up with the password reset for admin. And there we go, there's the prompt. So we can just put in our password from scratch. Thanks for watching.